On the 30th of July, we would have been together in Lourdes. And I want to welcome you from Shrewsbury Cathedral for the beginning of this online pilgrimage to Lourdes for 2020. Well, I'm delighted to welcome you all from a, a rather overcast Stockport, Our Lady's Grotto at Our Lady's Church in, in Stockport. It's not quite Lourdes, but it's lovely that you're all joining us on this virtual pilgrimage. It's so sad that we can't be in Lourdes. We're so used to all the friendships that we renew each year there and, and that sense of family that is such an apparent part of, of our Lord's pilgrimage, I think. Um, and that was one of the reasons why we wanted to, to have this virtual pilgrimage, because although we're one of the largest pilgrimages from England that goes to Lourdes, there is very much a sense of family and that we all know each other, we belong together. People come back year in, year out, renew their friendships, and new people come each year and immediately feel part of our family. So we wanted to keep that sense of, of family and belonging together. And so our virtual pilgrimage will have a series of mass each day um, in different venues around our diocese led by priests who are very much part of our pilgrimage and of course our, our Bishop, Bishop Mark, opening and closing the, the, the pilgrimage. And many members of our pilgrimage family who will lead devotions and prayers and reflections with you over this time. We do encourage you to join us to keep the prayers going. Pray particularly for your friends who are part of the pilgrimage. Keep them in mind. Think of the some of our, our VIPs that maybe you've worked with or you've been with who are very precious to you. And keep them very much in your prayers over this week, this virtual pilgrimage together over this week. We hope that you will enjoy the, the services, the devotions, and feel very much part of our diocesan pilgrimage family. Good evening, everybody. Um, I just wanted to share a, a greeting with you and wish you all a, a good virtual pilgrimage. This is the time of night when people often head to the, the grotto and I thought it might be an appropriate moment just to, to say hello and uh, wish everybody well. And um, fond memories of uh, Lourdes and, and going to the grotto and that sort of thing. Um, we think of uh, the, these days and months and um, we hope for better days ahead, don't we? and uh, we keep our prayers going and ask Our Lady to help us and uh, I look forward to participating in the, the pilgrimage myself. So I wish you well, all the best now, bye bye. Hello everybody, I'm Nuala Fitzmaurice, matron for the Diocese of Shrewsbury Lord's Pilgrimage. I hope you are all well. Little did we know that at the beginning of 2020 that we and the people worldwide would be dealing with a global pandemic. We had to stay at home and stay safe. It goes without saying that is with great sadness and disappointment that we can't be there this year. None more disappointed than our assisted pilgrims. Some who year in, year out, make this special journey with us. They stay in the Akai where it is our great pleasure and honour and pri pri privilege for the care team to be there to meet their needs and to care for them. They join us at the services, at social events and gatherings. It is a very special time for them and for us. Hopefully, they will get to join us on our spiritual pilgrimage this year, which I'm sure will be very special uplifting and comforting for many. One of my favourite services in Lourdes has always been the Blessing of the Sick, which takes part in the Akai Notre Dame each year. It is always a very moving and uplifting service. It is with trust in Our Lady of Lourdes we will return in 2021 to be with her. Let us be united in prayer 
God bless. Hi, my name's Andy O'Brien. I'm the Safeguarding Coordinator for Shrewsbury Diocese. Welcome to the Lord's Virtual Pilgrimage. Hi, I'm Sandy. I'm the Director of Youth Mission for the Diocese of Shrewsbury. It's great to be with you this week in this live Lourdes experience. I know it's not what we'd expected. I know it's not what we wanted. We should be packing bags right now. We should be ready to go. But I know there's some really exciting stuff planned for this week. Don't forget to join us on Friday where we're going to present the Youth Liturgy. But this week it's about that experience of Lourdes, sharing the journey, even though we're hundreds of miles away. We can be together via social media and that's really exciting too. So I hope you have a great week. Enjoy the Lourdes pilgrimage, even if it is from the comfort of your own home. Have a good week. Hello, and welcome to the Shrewsbury Diocesan Virtual Pilgrimage to Lourdes. I'm Richard Emsley, and I'm the Chief Broncardier for the pilgrimage. It would have been my role to coordinate the work of all the volunteer helpers during our pilgrimage. For some of you, it would have been your first pilgrimage to Lourdes, or your first time working as volunteers. For others, you would have been enrolling in the diocesan hospitality after completing three years service. For many more, this week in Lourdes is now an annual event in our lives, and a unique opportunity to gather with friends and to serve the sick and Our Lady through the work we do there. Whatever your own personal circumstances, I share your disappointment that we're not able to be together in Lourdes this week and celebrate our shared faith. Instead, we're invited to participate in this virtual pilgrimage that will capture many of the services and processions that make up the Pilgrim's Day and are integral to our pilgrimage. And I hope you are able to join in with as many events as you can. Of course, there are elements that we cannot replicate in a virtual pilgrimage. Those first conversations with people who become lifelong friends, the feelings of humility when serving our assisted pilgrims, that sense of calm and peace around the grotto and prairie. For that reason, I hope that you will be able to join us on next year's pilgrimage, when we'll be gathered together again to fully experience Lords. Enjoy the week and God bless.